Hello, I'm Karin and I'm currently backpacking through Southeast Asia. Welcome to episode 6 in Hanoi, Vietnam. And what can I say? Food city, I had some of the best food ever. I also did a mini day trip to Halong Bay on a little cruise ship. Yay! It was really windy and super cloudy, but the views were pretty good and I went to the coolest cave that I have ever been to in my whole life. Like, look at that. I also tried, yes, egg coffee. Egg in coffee, guys. Which was, um, yeah. <laughs> um, and then I went to a lake in Hanoi where I saw a deceased fish. Um, rip and then I went to a gorgeous little not little it was pretty big cathedral and yeah that's it thanks for watching just landed in Hanoi I'm taking a bus to my hostel because I'm broke first time on a bus kind of nervous It's so chaotic here guys, I've been walking for like 10 minutes and it's so hard to cross the street. Yeah. Woo. Found my hostel guys. Waiting for a check in at 2 p.m. This is a really cool layout for a room. I haven't had, look, there's like stairs in the middle. And then there's a bathroom in the room. It's insane. I had to like go downstairs every time. So that's nice. This place is huge. That's my room over there. And this is the sixth floor. Really big. I'm gonna go to a restaurant nearby just to, you know, quickly grab dinner because I have to sleep early today and get ready for how long they tour tomorrow. I'm eating here. I got the traditional sticky rice with barbecue pork and crispy pork, I think, and I think everyone gets the cucumbers. <laughs> so that was my meal. Like honestly, at first, the plate was so small, so I was like, okay, this isn't going to be enough. I'm going to have to have a second dinner. But then like because it was sticky rice, I became so full and it was only like, I'd eaten like half of it. And I, it was, I'm just so full right now. I hope the weather clears up when we go to Halong Bay. These drivers are crazy, guys. I'm traveling alone. 
Oh my god. I didn't even go all the way up. I just went halfway up. And I was dying. I was like, I cannot do this. And then I came back down. Those people are enjoying the beach. Maybe I just need like exercise. But I did get like knee surgery recently, so it's like <laughs> sorry. But oh my god, that was one of the hardest things I have ever done. No cat. I like This is only like our first stop, so we're still gonna go to like two caves and do some like kayaking or we can go on like just a normal boat, we can choose I think. Yeah. Cave guys. Oh, so many stairs. Back to our boat. Sunday night. People have work tomorrow. Why are there so many people? For real. I'm gonna go sleep now. <laughs> I'm so tired. <laughs> Good night. Morning, morning. So right now it's 11 a.m. and I slept in because I was tired and I missed my walking tour that was free and I, I chose not to go in my bed so it was okay but that was supposed to be from 9 a.m. But it was like a guided tour and I was like, okay, I, I might want to like stop at restaurants and actually eat. So like it was mine. So now I'm going to eat to my plane. Guys, this is like the least flattering mirror there is. Because it's like, it makes you look fat. I found an 
I'm so excited. Like, I'm actually so excited. Oh, new shoes. I'm getting this one. So the food is here, but I didn't have pork in mine, which is like the, the staple. So I asked them to add some. So I'm waiting for the pork now. It looks so crispy. It's like sour. Thank you. Oh, yeah, sorry. Thank you. Thank you. So I got another seed. This is the pork one that they gave me. Garlic, chili, yum. It's like minced meat. This tastes so much better. It tastes pretty vinegary. Like, it tastes like vinegar. And the first one that I had, which I Apparently, like, accidentally ordered like the vegetarian version or something without the fork. It was like, it was very vinegary and it was like sour. And my expectation for this dish was like pretty high, so I was like, wait, it's not as good as I thought it would be. But this one with the meat, it just tastes completely different. And it's like, the meat is like roasted. Wait, I don't know how to say this in English. It's like with the charcoal, like on the do 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 do. And it's like that. So it's like you can really taste the meat. Like I'm so full. I was gonna have like three other dishes um, in like the next four hours, but I don't think I can. This is the cafe. Wow. Guys, I got an egg coffee ice. What in the world? The coffee is like at the bottom. So I think you mix it. And it's so nice. I got like little space, and there's like some outside. This is exciting. I heard that it just tastes like a liquid tiramisu. So... Yeah. It is like a tiramisu. But like in Japan, we eat like egg yolk on rice, right? So it weirdly tastes like that, which isn't very nice. So that was like one of the OG egg coffee places apparently. Honestly, I didn't really like it. Um, it's just, I don't know. I don't feel like it's supposed to be in a sweet beverage. Because I'm so used to thinking that eggs are like a savory food. It just, I don't know. It was weird. Okay, so I have a um a bit of time so i was i thought i'd come to the horn Kim lake to like walk around and see the cathedral nearby and this is what i see that's the first thing i saw and it's not a nice sight um yeah but the lake's nice for real the cafe culture here is so nice oh <gasps> wait that's the note coffee that's the, ca that's the cafe with all the post-it notes. Oh, well, I just had coffee, so I'm not going there, but... Oh, that's cool. You can literally see, like, the thousands of post-it notes. That's just everywhere. Oh my god. I just checked out this vintage store. It was super cool. 
Oh my gosh, I see the cathedral. Look at how goth core it is. Oh my gosh. I'm at the airport once again. Literally once every like four days. That's a lot. But a lot. <laughs> I love going on these. It's so fun. And I like to walk super fast when I love them. And then it feels like I'm walking like really fast. Thanks for watching guys, like and subs- no, no, you don't have to like and subscribe if you don't want to like and subscribe, um, yeah, anyways, catch me in Luang Prabang Lao next, see ya!